Hello peeps, Drugart here. Today I would like to show you how I fixed my sound issues for streaming with the OBS on Jossamite. So El Capitan is out already, still like most gaming streamers, stuff like that. There the thing is you want to record your game audio and you want to record your mic. Doing that is a bit complicated because that usually was done using Soundflower, but it caused issues since a few OS X versions back. Basically what I was looking for is uh, first, like, is there a new Soundflower version? And there was, there we go. So there is a new Soundflower version, which just updates the driver. So you still have to use the older Soundflower bed, but also this thing, you know, made cause issues like sound issues this time, like crackling noises and stuff like that. So I was seeking for another driver and I found one. And this is how basically I fixed my sound issues being able to record the game audio, which you can't hear right now because I'm recording this with ScreenFlow and I have actually running the streaming setup here, which um, says the, mul the multiple output device is the actual output. And ScreenFlow would like to have its system sound from the built-in output. And so I had to disable the built-in, you know, don't record the system audio, just my voice, so I could record. Of course, I also could record in, in, in um, OBS, but you know, preference, I love my screen flow, it works. <laughs> anyway, um, so as you can see, I also removed the aggregated device and the other multiple output device I normally had used for Soundflower. So I figured when I installed the new driver, um, it still did not work. So then I deinstalled Soundflower just using the uninstall script and then it worked. So I'm guessing there is a little conflict there. Like, you know, same conflict maybe like ScreenFlow has, not sure. Anyway, we don't need this anymore. Just a piece of advice, you also should uninstall um, Soundflower if you want to use this new driver, which is called Kubatec Audio Loopback. And I found this on uh, a website. Here it is. That's the link. I'll put that in the description. Um, the audio loopback is basically a sound driver for Windows and uh, Mac OS X. And here we have the Mac OS X part. So what you see here is um, basically this little schematic describes perfectly what it does. So here you have your applications like your play sound and your, you know, whatever. And all this goes into the default audio. And now what you do is you create a multiple output device and say you don't, you want it to be, you know, put out here and put out to the audio. Okay. So then you take this input then in OBS from the audio as this is your system sound. Basically, the uh, well, the game in the background just creates some static noises. Uh, maybe I can put them in here. Anyway, and for the second device, I just used my Yeti. So that's uh, the setup I'm running now. Um, you can't change the system volume anymore because uh, you are not using the built-in output. So you have to adjust the uh, volume meters here for input and output separately. Um, yeah, basically that's what you do. And for not streaming and trying to normally record, uh, record you better go back to, you know, putting the built-in output on instead of the uh, multi-output device. So this is how it fixed my sound for me. So hopefully this will help you as well. As I said, link will be put in the description. So if you like this video, please leave a like. And um, when you're around here, uh, maybe check out my channel 
and especially share this video with other people which might have the same issues. So, yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye.